Hey everyone, welcome to Echo Calyp. So let's uh, go over my account. Um, been playing for six days, I think. Yeah, six days. So tomorrow is my day seven. So far, I've uh, I'm at level forty-seven in terms of the account. Um, opened up most of the content. Syndicate is actually open already. Uh, as for patrol. I already opened Liberation. So I think most of the content I've opened so far. So far, I think. But um, we are actually ways away from, you know, from getting that far. So, so far, that is where I am in terms of Steel Ambition. I'm at only at 57. I'm not sure if I'm going to get Niz at this point. I joined the game late already so niz is kind of out of the question uh let's go to the case that i have so far so i have one two uh, yulia ferrero kiki set bastet stara garula regina and baphomet for my ssr so Based on what I have, do you think I use the best ones? Or are there anyone here who is uh, from the six that I haven't used? Are there any, you know, are they good enough that I should swap them out? I'm actually using a team wherein there is a lot of uh, synergy built into them and as well as DPS. So let's take a look at my squad. For my squad, uh, Fenrir, of course, is uh, here. She's actually free. Um, Yulia is here. Snezana is here as well. Uh, Yor is good for healing. Then you have Kiki. Kiki is surprisingly good DPS. And you have here Senko. So that is my team. So far for equipment... Um, I only have uh, Shatter for SRs. I have this incomplete set. Then I have this complete set with uh, with uh, Kiki here. So as for their levels, they're at 42, most of them. And if you take a look at their boost, Augment is roughly at around 3. Only one is 4. Or yeah, only 2 is 4. So the rest are three going four. Breakthrough wise, um, so far I only have one for Yulia, that and two and two for Fenriru. So that is how I have been. Actually, I'm happy with this team so far. In terms of the deployment, so this is how I my deployment looks like. Assist wise. These these girls are really giving me a lot for the links that I have. So link activated is 14. You should make sure that you have a high activation for link so that it will give you a lot of bonuses for your combat team. Artifact is I have Crown of Baal. So the first one. So it deals 33 damage and uh, to random increase allies attack by 15%. This is the first one because I'd like to put a buff if I do on auto, so that is the first to trigger. The next one is this one, a burn damage for one. Then this one is a stun. There's a damage plus 60% to inflict stun on target with the highest HP. This is damage on the front row. And the last one is actually very crucial. Take note that um, it's really important to have a little bit of healing, um, especially for your artifact, additional healing especially if you have a tank that needs a lot of healing so that is it so i put kiki here for immediate damage dps at first then you have your tank here yula in the middle then fenriru that is my front line you have the snes hana at the back iori for healing and senkek senko for additional dps and all around you know um she's the one i think that i should replace eventually but i'm still i'm still waiting for this to be open so that i could place her here and probably replace her with somebody else so that is what 
I'm thinking and that is so far that is so far my deploy to activate deploy two to activate attack plus 90 okay so this is leader buff case resonance so I only have two so far armor percentage deploy three SSR characters from the same two factions. So I have to have I have to have at least one more to activate this. This is for SSRs. So that is the buff for SSRs as well. So please take note of that as you accumulate SSRs. Then uh, let's check out which faction do I need. So they are let's just check them out. Going back to the cases here. So I do have, let's uh, go through the Bifrost. So I only have two. So I lack one more SSR to put in the team and additional buffs for my squad. Okay, so that is it. So the reason for the rest, just want to go back. Fenrirro, of course, um, uh, damage for all. So she's the sweeper. Snezana also, she's a sweeper for the front. She's high damage. Iori would be your healer. Again, they complement each other. I like this team so far. And um, just to, actually, I just, I'm near the, the point wherein I'm satisfied with my lineup already. So a lot more to summon. So far, I don't have any more summons. I did a summon video. Uh, just before this one so that is it guys so so far storehouse nothing too special here uh, we, we've discussed artifact the case the squad and for the complex so so far i am archives i'm already good as for my dormitory uh can I give somebody a bath? No, not not now. Okay. So, so far, this is how my dormitory looks like. And my work agency. I'm going to click all of these. And let's see if I can level up this building. No, I need 40 more. So, that is it. Slowly but surely, six days of playing. I uh, have to open something up. Activate these. So that we could add member HP bonus. Okay. There you go. So far, overall, my thoughts on the game. Um, I don't mind the autoplay at this point. There are a lot of content in this game that if you don't auto, you'll really, you'll really spend a lot of time. So I don't really mind. Um, I don't really mind the autoplay so a lot of content to do from your complex to syndicate to patrol to looking for combat missions and also looking through this one don't forget this because this is what tells you what you need to do before you you know you don't play the game anymore and that's it so thank you guys so comments on my you know on my account so what do you think of my account what do you think of my squad do you think they are good which ones should i replace which ones should i use based on this and based on the remaining cases that i have so there they are i have uh, six remaining ssrs that i haven't used and the rest are ours Okay, guys, so again, thank you very much for staying this far. So take care, stay safe. This is The Warden, and I'm out of here.